Um, I'm making this video because I'm just feeling really sketchy and um, I can't seem to shake it off and there's no reason that I should be feeling this way you know I'm I'm in such a good place. I'm surrounded by incredible people. But um, for some reason, the last, about the last 24 hours, I'm just feeling um, really low and anxious. I can normally pinpoint it and I normally know why, but I can't seem to get to the bottom of this, <sighs> which is winding me up even more. All the things I usually do that make me feel better aren't working. And, um,. I suppose I just wanted someone to talk to really, even if it's only myself on film, you know, because you don't want to burden people, you don't want to tell people your feelings crap. Um, So, I don't know, I don't really know what else to say. I, trying to use this as some kind of outlet to, to say how I'm feeling and um, hoping it might make me feel a bit better. Um, it's very hard filming myself when I'm feeling like this because who wants to admit to anyone that they don't feel great which I think is part of the problem I mean every time I've picked up my phone in the last few days I've read about someone else committing suicide it's It's quite depressing that there's young people, you know. Um, the one that really got me that might surprise people is um, Mike Thalassitis. Most people won't even know who he is and most people probably won't care and be quite dismissive of it. But he was a young lad that went on Love Island. And <laughs> he... He hung himself. This young lad was 26 years old, I think. Somebody's son. And people loved him and people cared about him, but for some reason, he didn't see any other way out. He was in such a dark place that he hung himself, he killed himself, and... I can't help thinking that... if we lived in a world where it was a bit more acceptable for men to ask for help, that... that he may have got the help that he needed, because... now... You know, I 
I don't know why that got to me so much. I don't know whether it's because he was so young or because... I don't know. It's just lately there seems to be so many people. So many people that the only way out for them is, is suicide. And that's the whole reason I'm doing what I'm doing is to stop this. <laughs> is to stop people from from thinking that that's their only way out. Is that maybe if mental health illnesses were a bit more normalised and a bit more understood, that maybe the male suicide...